Hoi there, it is rain and we are having a very, very different video today. A long time ago, um, it might be, even be years now, probably years, I posted a few videos about um, some things I built on the Craft server and a lot has changed since then. And I haven't uploaded a video regarding Ghibli Craft in, in a very long time. Um, so this is, is probably going to be my last video on Ghibli Craft because of some things I am going to discuss right now. While we take a little bit of a tour around um, the Ponyo world. And I'll explain why the Ponyo world in particular. Uh, so let's let's go on a little walk, shall we? The house I was standing on just a second ago. It's actually one of the builds I did when I was a builder. The first build I made in Ponyo, but not the last build. Um, it doesn't even look that Japanese if I'm completely honest with you, but it's fine, I guess. It's, it's tolerable <laughs> for what it is. So yeah, this, this is the area I started in and, um, I guess a lot has changed since I started building here. The previous manager, um, had to do some schoolwork, I believe. And I got contacted by one of the admins on on the Ghibli Craft server asking whether I would be available to do management work and I agreed. Late 2018, I was asked. And now it is mid-2020, so it's been about a year and a half. Um so I've been I've been working on this world. One of the first things I ended up doing was ripping up all the buildings from the floor and uh, putting them in the sky and then redoing the terrain for this entire area. Um, um, started in this area and then it went to an area on a hill. Um, that's where a lot of other buildings ended up being. So a lot of these buildings, uh, when you build something on the server, you are usually able to click and find out the information on um, who built that thing and when they built that thing. Um, but a lot of these buildings have had that information removed, unfortunately, because I ended up messing with them with World Edit, uh, picking them up and then placing them back down. So there was a, uh, a, a few tiny, tiny issues that arose with that. Um, because obviously it's hard to tell who built what now, uh, but I'm going to see what I can do about crediting people, I guess, because I guess it's pretty unfair for me to, like, not show off my own work this time and not credit anyone. Um, let's, let's go up on the hill. So here's the deal, right? It's been a year and a half. Of working on the server, I, a lot of effort has been put into getting the this world uh, to how it is right now. Um, and you know, I am 22 right now. I am almost 23, and I have, you know, I have my my own dreams and desires and. Um, I guess one of them is is um, having somewhat of a stable art career and I can't do a lot of things and focus on my art the amount I need to focus on my art. Um, so you know some problems will arrive from that. So I decided uh, it is time for me to focus on me more and stop worrying about this server and 
if I've been online this week and accepted enough jobs this week, that kind of thing. Um, and my things have been slowing down with me. Um, so it, it was about time I started, um, you know, moving on to other things. It's been a long time. I, um, I believe I started on the server, uh, February of 2018. So, um, that's when I got accepted to be a builder, February 2018. I think it was on Valentine's Day, actually. Um, of course, I do remember Valentine's Day. Um, so, yeah, it's been a long time. And I've had two jobs since. And they've both, like, considerably um, affected the amount of effort I could put into... Uh, being on the server and you know that's not that's not fair when someone else could be doing this this stuff and you know not worrying about time and trying to get their life sorted out um so yeah I guess I guess I've grown out of it I guess I need to do adult stuff and <laughs> sort myself out um of course this doesn't have to be permanent I'm not one to say like I will never come back on the server ever again but um I don't see myself being in a position where I'm like right time to be a manager again you know because <laughs> there's just so much things I can do right now I've got my art I need to be doing, I've got streaming, YouTube, um, I, I want to get some books out that I've been trying to work on, I've got a, a visual novel I want to do as well, um, so it's, it's not like I, I don't have anything to do, I have a lot to do, um, I think even when I started on the server, there was one point where I just left for three months. <laughs> Didn't really tell, tell anyone about it. I ended up doing two comics. Um, I just put all my time into it. And they turned out pretty, pretty well. Those are the, um, that's the main focus of, of the, the books I'm trying to get out. Um, those two comics. I'm going to add some more, more content to it. So, you know, um. So, so yeah, I know I can work harder when I don't have, um, like this to worry about. And it's been fun. It's been a fun two years, two years and four months, I guess. Um, and, you know, there's, there's a lot to miss about it, but I think the newfound freedom will be, will be great too, you know? So what is the Jubilee craft server? And like, like I say in every video, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, but it's whatever. So this, um, this whole server started several years ago, maybe coming up to seven or eight years now. Um, this guy, he's an animator called Alan Becker. If I'm pronouncing that right, I might not be. Um, he he wanted to build Spirited Away um, in Minecraft, and he did with his friend Koa. And um, it was great. It is great. And then it uh, the project got a lot bigger, and. Um, they got some more builders in, um, some more help in for like texture packs and um, 3D models and stuff and here we are today. We've got a huge project, several films being made that 
aren't spirited away and you know it's it's a functional team there's a lot of people here doing their thing the the whole place is a lot different to how it used to be um there's a lot of old faces that aren't here anymore a lot of old faces that aren't as here as much as they used to be there's a lot of new faces and um and management is a bit different to how it used to be as well but the world is still growing and new people are finding it um i believe alan's making video still on the progress of the world and that's all good and dandy um So yeah, it's, it's a nice little project. Well, it's not a little project, I guess. It's a big project and um, requires a lot more work than I am able to commit to right now. Um, if I want to, you know, do what I want to do. Um, there is definitely a lot of areas in this town that need work, like this area. There's a lot of trees that need to be planted. Um, there's a lot of paths that need to be fixed. Like, this is a bit of a mess, if I'm completely honest with you. It's pretty messy. I forgot to... Um come out of invisible so everything you've seen so far with the shader pack has been slight ever so slightly dodgy um i'm not gonna say like i'm so happy to leave this place behind because you know it's a it's a long time i've been on on the server even though as you know it's had its ups and downs like everything else in in life um i'm gonna miss it i guess i'm gonna miss it um at the same time i've been pretty antisocial on here so you know i don't think people is gonna realize it too much when i when i'm like gone for good which will be pretty soon um so this is the uh upon your house um there's been a few versions of this uh there was a version of the manager before my before me um there was my version and the, there's this version my version actually didn't have stairs um and the interior was, was quite a different um, style. The the out this outdoorsy area is pretty much the same as I left it. Um, it's 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 very interesting. If I do get to say so myself, let's go in through the back. Um, so yeah, a lot of these areas you can compare to um, a screenshot, several screenshots around the movie. Um, but of course the the transition into minecraft is pretty difficult with um keeping buildings a certain size and um this is so clever and um staying true to the references especially interiors um interiors are always going to be difficult when you're using references for them like this table for example is not this color in the movie but this is as close as we can get it to um of course things are different shapes and such um yeah there's of course the part in the film where where Sasuke is um 
gone down a back area if I can find it. Because it's up this direction. Yeah. It goes down here. Um, it's meant to be a lot of rocks down here. Um, that's obviously not the case. So um, there's a lot to fix. Um, it'd be great, of course, if... Um, If there was a quicker way to do this all, you know, a quicker way to plant so many trees and stuff like that. Uh, to the managers that are taking over this place, good luck, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I think I spent most of my time um, managing this place, planting trees. Uh, there's, there was a lot of trees that needed to be planted. This area I didn't even know was in the film, like, this detailed, but there's a screenshot that I completely missed, because I, I didn't take it. Um, I guess I can I can say some names of, of the um, builders and managers and stuff. Um, Velo is helping me on this world for a while, actually. He built that boat there. I I don't think I ever really went super close up on it. But it's it's really cool. Nighttime is so pretty with the shader. So this is um, Shinora Town, I believe. Maybe I'm saying it wrong. I'm gonna take you down to look at some other places. Um, I'll also leave all the links in the description if you wanna come and check it out for yourself. This is just gonna be like my personal tour of the world. Um, my personal recording before, you know, someone comes and changes it, which is fine. I've already accepted my fate, but yeah, of course, people are gonna come around and change things. Um, Alan's made videos on this place too, so I don't feel like you have to watch my video to see it all. There, there's like little videos around on this already. Um, it's sunrise. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Just watch it from in between the ship. The shader is so lovely. <laughs> So, so yeah, uh, one of the big problems we had, in, well I had, um, was this, this big old building here. It is so many different sizes from so many different references and there's still a dispute on, on, on where it should be, <laughs> whether it should be there or where I'm standing or over here. And in in every picture, it's it's different. Um, I I strongly recommend the building to stay where I put it because of course I am correct. <laughs> Whatever works for people works for people. If people can find a better place to put it, be my guest. Um, I welcome you to do <laughs> to do that. It is completely the wrong size in some references, and it's the perfect size in other references. Um, so yeah, I understand. <laughs> this, this, um, because you know the size of this building affects the size of the buildings around it too. You, you, you'd see a lot of the um the builders getting confused about what was supposed to be where. I like how um to get into this house, you need to go through the bushes 
and then over this little rickety bridge, this tiny, tiny rickety bridge. It's so overgrown and just homely. I love it. I really do. I, I love the little garden area too. It's so pretty. The little outdoor toilet. <laughs> it's a lot of time to just be done with, you know? I'm a little sad, to be honest. Because, you know, I was so excited to, to do this thing. I didn't know how long I was going to be around for. I just knew I was going to do it. And I love, I love Studio Ghibli films. They're, they're, they're like, they're great. <laughs> I grew up with them, you know. So obviously, when I when I had this, this server, I wanted I wanted to stick my nose in it, and I did, and my nose got pretty far in. Um, kind of crazy, two and a half years and. All this work. This area is really nice because um, the builders had a lot of free reign on the height of these buildings. So it's a lot more interesting than down there. Um, down there was also like um, uh, mixed management. Up here is, is, is m m all my management work. Um, what about what I mean by management work is like planning, floor plans, um, environment, um, little things like <laughs> forgetting to finish all oh, this electrical pole. Oh, I'm terrible. <laughs> I should do that. I need to finish that. Uh, there are also these these buildings that was built by um, some people that were on the server. I mean, of course, they were built by people on the server. I believe um, Sushi did this one. It's uh, the the little school with the sand pits and playground. classrooms um i i did pick this up with a world edit and put it back down and broke the bikes this is the the old people's home if that's what it's called it's not finished at all um i don't know when this is gonna get sorted but i i believe i believe the managers will figure it out <laughs> <laughs> they, uh, they have to figure it out. I, I probably should have, um, <laughs> I don't know, done something about it. This looks like it needs to have a little lamp, but I don't know. I guess someone will figure it out from the reference eventually. And this is the last place I worked on management-wise. Um, so yeah, I built this path up to this little shrine entrance, well, temple entrance. I'm not super, um, accustomed to Japanese culture, so I'm sure I'll get a lot of stuff wrong 
or maybe it's because it's Minecraft, like, you won't be able to tell too much. But, um, this is just a temple area that I made from a reference I saw on the hill. Um, so, like, I built the environment, but, you know, these buildings were built by, um, some builders. I'll, I'm going to put the names on the screen instead of saying them. I don't want to say the wrong names and be awkward. Um... So yeah, this this is a great building. Um, really chuffed with it. Uh, this, I believe, I don't know what it's called. I just know it's a um, it's a temple building. I don't know what building it is. It's just a temple building. Um, so they've got some places where you can stay I guess these rooms and I believe these are bathrooms are they yeah they are I, I, I really like this area um really well built really well built this is higher up some more rooms which is great um, it's crazy how much you can do with this kind of space. Oh wait, let me see. All right, okay. I was just checking if you could go through that direction. Um, there's a kitchen place up here. So, I believe this kind of building is where all the monks would go to eat and sleep. Um, or like if tourists were going around, they, they could come here and stay. Which is nice. This is uh, the last building I built. Um, as a manager, I guess, as a builder too. Uh, this is where you cleanse yourself, I guess. Um, this is just some rooms with tatami floors, some storage, and these are meant to be closets. I don't know if they pass <laughs> very well. Um, and this is outside to a nice little garden area. This is meant to be sand. <laughs> oh. I am I like this build. <laughs> I've never built something like this before. And this is where you come, um... You come to pray, and you give an offering. And you pull this. This is meant to be like a bell kind of thing. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah. <laughs> I am gonna call it here. Um. This is the Ponyo world in in Jubilee Craft. Um, you can visit the server um, with the IP play.jubileecraft.com. Um, check it out if you are super into building. Apply to be a builder, I guess. Um, It was fun. It was, it was fun, all right. All right. So, everyone, I hope you like this mini tour. Um, hope you like looking at the builds and amazing work done by the builders. I'm gonna see. Oh, ooh, oopsie daily. <laughs> 
what I can do about um, giving credit. I'll probably put some names on the screen here now. Um, so, yeah, thanks everyone. And I guess it's time to open a new chapter and stop wearing this ridiculous skin. I believe it's uh, My Hero um, Academia uniform with my old uh, demon and uh, OC, <laughs> which I've changed since. But just, just, just look at these, like, these just amazing shots. I just, I can't. It's, <laughs> it's so nice and relaxing and pretty. <sighs> this is what growing up is, I guess. You put your effort into things that that can support you more, I guess. Um, so yeah. Bye everyone.